technology shaping the future of transport systems? Um, okay, thank you very much for inviting me. Uh, how I consider that string transport. This is the only one really sustainable, safe and affordable solution that we have now in hands, especially applicable to developing countries. Mm. And I, 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 I will not fight, but I am ready to argue and I am ready to prove my arguments. Because 90% what I am hearing, to be honest, it's a little bit far from reality. What is the reality? Reality, by 2040, the number of cars on the road will be doubled. It means that in order to stay in these terrible traffic jams like we have now, for example, in Jakarta, we have to build two times more roads, two times more bridges, two times more overpasses. Just 16 years left. It means that transport collapse is coming. And with all my respect to two-wheel bicycle and bikes, all these people in Indonesia who are driving bikes, they are dreaming of buying car. What to do? There is no space on the road. There is no any other territory in Jakarta or somewhere else to be put under the asphalt. That is why there are, no too, there are not too many options. And again, please consider the number. By 2040, the number of cars on the road will be doubled. No matter, it will be petrol, diesel or electrical, zero emission or something like this. Think how you will reach the office. A. Think how much you will pay for electricity. The matter is not what kind of energy I am consuming. The matter how much can energy I am consuming. And three, Professor, you are completely right. 1.3 million people are killed in the traffic accidents. So how much it will be reduced only by the fact that I am switching from petrol car to electric car? I don't think too much. Still, I am driving Tesla and I will sleep. I will drunk drive, not me, somebody else. <laughs> and they will create traffic accident. So it means that something else should be done. And this is, there is only one answer from my point. This is string transport. <laughs> so do you think that uh, 